friends, welcome back to my channel. It is me, Olana. For this video, I wanted to talk about my goals for 2022. So, um, I have a few goals in regards to my reading and my channel and just my year overall. My big overarching goal for 2022 is actually just to graduate from grad school. <laughs> and do well <laughs> so that's like the prominent goal but I do have some goals in mind uh, just for where I want my reading to go how I where I want my channel to go things that I want to kind of incorporate more and all of that so my first goal I think my reading goal is going to be 50 books um, in 2022 mostly because uh, I could do it do a hundred but I just want to keep it low and hope that I go over that's kind of what I did in 2021 and so I want to do it again this coming year mostly because I don't really want to stress myself out with numbers if that makes sense like I, I definitely know I could easily go over 50 books but I just don't want to stress myself with a, an outrageous goal like I usually do and then for my channel I would really 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 love to hit 2k uh in 2022 i think it's possible because right now i'm at 1900 so it's definitely a possibility i just gotta keep with my consistency maybe change up some content i don't know but that would be a dream goal right now it's a goal i've had for a while um but it wasn't really Feel like reachable until now so i'm kind of excited for that also i would love to get monetized next year um will it happen i don't know <laughs> but it's a goal it would be nice it would be awesome uh if i could do that i was halfway there in 2021 and then i went on my little hiatus and i lost it so i kind of got to rebuild again but that's okay. I gotta put. I just gotta put more hard work into it, and maybe I will get there. I know my other goal is to make sure that I'm posting more consistently again. I kind of lost my consistency in 2021 because I moved and I started school, and just so much was happening in my life. Um, but I feel like I have my energy back. I feel like I have my motivation back for my channel, and I'm hoping this stays so that way I can build that consistency again and have my posts and videos and maybe even do some reading sprints again when I can fit in the time for it. So that's what I'm hoping. I know I do also want to incorporate more vlogs into my channel. Um, I kind of started maybe in 2019 and then I kind of weaned off of it because I just didn't feel like I was doing well with them. But I want to build them back up again and start doing them again. Um, mostly because I have fun and um, I have a lot of good ideas for vlogs I could be I could do so that's kind of where I want to go with it but also still making sure to post um, sit down videos like this as well if I want um, another thing is I want to go on a book buying ban I think next year is just gonna be the year where I only buy my anticipated reads because my spending did get out of hand in 2021 and I have too many books <laughs> and I never say that but I do because I look at the I look at all the books I have and I'm overwhelmed by the fact that majority of them are not read so that's kind of a two-part goal too of limiting my book buying but also dwindling down my own TBR so like reading the books um, but also if they are not books I enjoy, making sure to get rid of them, to pass them on to secondhand shops or whoever else wants them. Making sure to not just hoard them um, because I am lazy <laughs> to take them anywhere else. So I need to do that and make sure I can dwindle them down because I want to make more space on my shelves rather than buy more shelves, if that makes sense. So also making sure to get rid of the books that have been on my shelves for the longest time that I have not read. So any books that have been on my shelves for longer than maybe a year or two, I should just go ahead and probably get rid of them because I'm probably not going to read them at this point in time. My reading taste changes all the time so I feel like it's probably time to let those books go. So 
to getting rid of the hoarder inside of myself, basically. And then, um, I think for my channel too, I kind of want to incorporate more of my other interests. Um, so keeping this mainly a book channel, of course, because that's what I love to talk about most, but maybe incorporating um, manga content because I do enjoy manga. I have a lot of the a lot of manga. I have a lot of recommendations and stuff like that, and opinions and favorites. Um, and anime too. I have so many anime favorites and recommendations. But also K dramas and C dramas. I watch a lot of those. So I would love to find a way to incorporate those into my channel too, if that's what everybody is interested in seeing as well um because i love talking about those and i would love to find fellow c drama watchers because majority of my friend friends watch k dramas which i enjoy for the most part but i tend to lean more towards the c drama side of things and i would love to find a fellow c drama watchers to obsess over things about basically um but yeah i think those are my overarching goals for my channel um in 2022 i'm just hoping that i can grow more also growing my reading tastes more as well i feel like i grew a lot taste wise in 2021 i feel like i really read a lot outside of my comfort zone which is normally ya i read a lot of romance and a lot of fantasy um i read some adult fantasy which i never thought i would so just making sure that's growing more too in 2022 that's pretty much it um hopefully these make sense hopefully i can reach them but yeah so they, those are my goals um let me know if you like the video please with that thumbs up down below if you have any comments questions concerns leave all that in the comment section below let me know what your reading goals or channel goals or whatever life goals you have for 2022 are i would love to hear about them if you are not good at commenting, I'm going to go ahead and say leave me a, a yellow heart emoji because yellow is a joyous color. And if you want to see more videos from me, please hit that subscribe button. You are awesome flowers in a world full of weeds.